it's all worthwhile. You can put a lot of passion and energy into it, and so that's quite exciting to me. My name is Daniel Chapman. I'm a second year master's student at the Frank Lloyd Wright School of Architecture. I was originally born in Australia. My uncle, he was an architect, and he noticed that I was left-handed, and he said, oh, all the best architects are, are left-handed. And it was really um, going along with Frank Lloyd Wright's principle of learn by doing, by, by designing, by then building, pouring concrete, cutting wood, using metal. You're learning how all these different materials work. My name is Jason Silverman, and I'm the residence life manager for the Frank Lloyd Wright School of Architecture. The shelter program uh, really dates back to 1938 when they came out here from uh, Wisconsin and there was nothing here. So it really started out with these basic little sheep herders tents and then uh, pretty soon the students started to design and build these little shelters of their own. And then over the years that sort of developed uh, not only as a necessity, you know, in lieu of having dormitories, but it also became a very important part of how the students are learning by doing. So I called this project Incognito, the emphasis on in it, you know, because I really wanted to feel that you were like in the nature and up here, you know, you're like as close to this tree as you could be and, and this tree here, the ironwood, the Palo Verde. At the end of the day, I just really want to design, you know, anything, you know, all these different elements of your life that he kind of built and installed in this place and, and that kind of continues today, learning how to be in the nature and work with it to protect yourself but also to embrace it.